Is Tom Brady really, really in trouble for making a comment about the, uh, about the officiating apparently after not. signing his deal? Uh, apparently, they're not going they to do They shouldn't do that. I mean, he's taking – and by the way – that was uh, he was absolutely in the right to say what he was saying he at the time. He has to say that as as an, that they should not have ejected Brian Branch yeah, from that football game. That's his job. I don't understand how he could possibly well, be because you're not have allowed to, to disparage and officiating his membership. I know he's going to have to walk a very fine line. I had no issue with what he said, at and all. I don't think he should have been penalized. But he is going to have to walk a fine he line. He couldn't have. Been, he could have been far more strident. Correct. And I think he was. I'm not saying he was pulling a punch. I was saying he was just not as strident as. Others might be, uh, and I don't know if he's sitting up there thinking, uh-oh, if I say that the uh, New York uh, officials that decided to eject Brian Branch like he's playing for Alabama, like this was a targeting rule where you just take a look at what the helmet was doing mm -hmm. and where it hit the player, and we're not taking intent into this situation. I don't think Brian Branch was intending to harm anybody. Um, I was surprised he got ejected. That's a 15-yard penalty. Yeah, but we're ejecting him from you know, a game, I, yeah. from a game that the entire country is watching between the first-place Lions and the second-place Packers. You're going to eject the best defensive player for the Detroit Lions in the middle of the second quarter of this game. So Tom Brady, as the guy who is sitting there in front of millions of people who want to hear what Tom Brady has to say, I think he did the right thing, and I hope. He is not going to be. Uh, apparently, they're not going to. Good. At least I read that. And and you know, what look, would they do anyway? Tom, how, do you, how do you? How would you? Oh, penalize you want to know about how you get fined and stuff? As a as a, a minority owner of the National Football League, well, I absolutely some, want okay, to know. Okay, so um, we never had a minority owner fined during my years with the team, but we did get fines. Um, Wait a minute, Al Davis got fined. Did you ever get fined personally? Was it? Oh, that's you did. Aim. Oh no, go. I never did. I got letters from the officiating department. Oh, and with letters Pereira? from. I got one from guess? Pereira. I know I should have mentioned that, and I got ones from executives at the league. Amy, we are aware of your behavior in the press box. What did you last do? What did you do? I simply voiced my opinion. Um, with an F-bomb? With an F-bomb? To, I don't know. That, there might have been. Um, but look, the NFL sends to every game No, 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 no. An no, we're not done. We're not done. No, 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 I'm, I'm okay, backing okay, okay. to explain. She dances around. No, no, no. no, no. I'm not, did you say an F-bomb? No, wait a minute. Let me give the setup for people that aren't familiar with this in a game. The yes. NFL sends to every game an observer of officials. And that observer of officials sits in the press box. An observer of officials? Yeah, an observer of trash. A triple O? An observer of officials. So I, in our press box in Oakland, one week in particular, I remember I was so angry at that which was going on on the field. And yes, as Pereira said last week, when I would see a call I didn't like or if there was a call I thought should have been made that wasn't, yeah. they did a countdown in New York in the officiating control center, the countdown to how long it would be until I called Pereira. You know, sometimes it was five, four, three, two, one. Sometimes it was 10 or 20 seconds. One time in particular, I was so angry. You didn't even call New York. I, oh, I did. You went but straight to the I triple But after I called them, I went straight over to that observer officials. And Suze, I think there were F-bombs involved. I and I just went off on them. I'm like, I just was, it was incomprehensible to me what the official on the field did. Well, apparently said observer of officials ratted me out. And I got the letter <laughs> from the league office the next week saying that my behavior was inappropriate. Oh. And it was a warning letter. Jeez. Did, and did Al get a copy? Was, was, it, was, Al I, was so proud of it. I was so proud of it. I was walked it into Al's <laughs> office. <laughs> did, it have to do with, did it have to do with Tom Brady? And oh, no, 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 no. It was, I don't even remember the so, game because I did this so often. So Tom would get a letter is what you're saying? Like somebody in, in the, like what the, No, this is see, this is very different because. What's and, the and, entity that would send him a letter? Well, that's the thing I'm about to say. It's a different situation with Tom because he's got fiduciary responsibilities to Fox. That's his employer. Yes. And he has fiduciary responsibilities to the Raiders because he's a limited partner. Yes. And so it's a it's a little bit of an odd dance. Does the league send the letter to Fox or does the league send the letter to the Raiders or does the league not send a letter at all? And my, my guess is it's a third. In my case, the league always sent me the letter that I was behaving poorly right. and it reminded me of growing up when my mom and dad would always get the she's a behavior problem <laughs> letter and, you know, we're going to you know, put her in detention and we're going to put a... Oh not, can you goodness. imagine little, we're like, little now. Amy? Oh, yeah. Now we're doing therapy here. Can you no, imagine no, little I was Amy? Proud. I got the, you know, we're going to... put in the corner. We're going to suspend her. We're going to detain her. She's going to get demerits. Well, I got those letters from the league office that if I didn't start behaving differently with the observer of officials, they were going to fine me. Wow. And I showed it to my husband and he's like, you know, do what you want, but could you not get us fined? 
Check out new episodes of What the Football with Susie Schuster and Amy Trask every Tuesday. Watch us on the Rich Eisen Show YouTube page or follow and listen wherever you get your podcasts.